A major deadly crash overnight over in West Fort Worth. Our Scott Sanford joins us in the newsroom with more details on that. Scott, this could be a DWI type crash. That's right, Madison. Uh, that's something we're working to fully confirm. But I do want to tell you uh, what happened. Uh, everything started around 1.30. This was on Loop 820 uh, in the northbound lanes. This is what we know so far. Police tell us one person is dead and three others were transported to the hospital. According to police, the 18-wheeler involved in the accident, which you see right there, plowed into the back of at least two vehicles. The woman who was killed was in the first vehicle, a smaller sedan, and three other people were transported to the hospital. They were in the SUV. Shots from our photojournalist, Tim Laveau, show just how mangled some, some of the cars are. And we're just learning that police are expected to charge the truck driver with a DWI-related offense. He was also taken to the hospital to be checked out and, and is in police custody. As you can see from our tech stock camera here, all northbound lanes on 820 are shut down still. Traffic is beginning to back up. So if you are driving on the west side of Fort Worth, this is something you're going to want to avoid if possible. This wreck is just past the White Settlement exit and traffic is being forced off at White Settlement Road. So there are still some details that we're trying to confirm. Um, we're not sure how long the lanes are going to be shut down on 820. So we'll keep you updated on air and online as we learn more. That's the latest from the desk. I'll send it back to you.